Understanding KW, KVA, and KVAR in electrical power when dealing with electrical power, three key terms often come up. KW, kilowatt, KVA, kilovolt ampere, and KVAR, kilovolt ampere reactive. Each represents a different aspect of power consumption and supply in electrical systems. What is KW, kilowatt, active power? KW represents the real power consumed by electrical loads, such as lights, TVs, fans, and other appliances. It is the power that actually performs useful work and is measured by the equation. P, KW, equals voltage times current times power factor. What is KVA, kilovolt ampere, apparent power? KVA is the total power supplied to a system, including both active, KW, and reactive, KVAR, power. It represents the capacity of electrical generators or transformers and is given by S, KVA, equals voltage times current. What is KVAR, kilovolt ampere reactive, reactive power? KVAR is the power that does not perform useful work, but is necessary for devices like induction motors to function properly. It is used to maintain the magnetic fields in motors and transformers. The equation for reactive power is Q, KVAR equals voltage times current times sin, theta. Why does this matter? KW is what you are billed for in energy consumption. KVA determines the size of generators and transformers needed for a system. KVAR impacts power factor efficiency and is managed using capacitors in industrial settings. Did you know? Improving power factor, reducing KVAR, can lower energy costs and reduce strain on electrical grids.